TEFL TESOL Guide to Teaching English Abroad The English language ability level of your students can also vary widely. You may find yourself teaching a group of beginner students, a group of very advanced students or anything in between. The type of English that is taught can also differ. Younger learners are probably going to be learning more basic English through games and activities, while business people may wish to learn specific English for their industry. Some adults may wish to learn English for traveling purposes, some might just want conversation to brush up on their language skills, while others want a deeper understanding of the grammar and structure. Fortunately most employers will provide a curriculum and have a library of textbooks and resource materials that you can utilize in your classes. You could be teaching individual students, small groups or large groups, and so you have to be prepared to teach at all ability levels, age ranges, group sizes and from a variety of materials. This is why some form of training is essential for all responsible teachers. What experience qualifications are required? As mentioned previously most jobs will require you to have some form of teaching certification to be a teacher. This certification can be quickly and relatively inexpensively obtained through taking a TEFL or TESOL course. These courses will certify you to teach English overseas as well as equipping you with all the knowledge and skills that you need to start teaching English. TEFL courses can be taken as an intensive course in a classroom setting, as a distance learning or online course, or a combination of the two. Other than that no additional teaching qualifications or experience are usually required. If you wish to specialize in teaching children or teaching business English, then there are additional specialist qualifications that you can obtain. Further information on these qualifications can be found in part 2 of this guide or on our website www.teflcourse.net.